This is better than my imagination This is more than a dream come true Without the slightest bit of hesitation I knew what I was meant to do This is the tough part about science. Naming the inventions. How about Bob? No. Should be something that's... Something that really sings. How about... Synaptic Neuro Enhancer? How about Bob? When this is perfected, it will increase learning capacity through a magnification of synaptic transmission. Could I borrow this for my chemistry exam on Friday? Whatever happened to good old-fashioned studying? It sort of lost out to getting ready for this big ski weekend up north. Andrew, Andrew, Andrew. When it comes to accomplishing your goals, there is no substitute for dedication and hard work. I know. It took me most of last night, but I found this incredible ski jacket. If it isn't one thing, it's another. As a kid, homework didn't bite. You should see Henry on his wheel. I bet he can run faster than you. You'd lose. Oh, this is gonna be great. Just me and the mountain. And the ambulance attendants. Remember what happened last year? I didn't break my ankle. I only sprained it. Besides, that was cross-country skiing. This is downhill. It's different. Oh. Uh, could one of you guys get that for me, please? Hello? Yes, this is she. Andrew? Could you set the table for me, please? Do I have to do everything around here? Really? You do? Well, uh, thank you. Yeah, bye. Mother Magazine wants to do a story on me. What's it going to be about? Me. Working mother. Oh, right. <laughs> That's great, Mom. I wonder when Fabulous Daughter Magazine's going to call. Kids. So, Jackie, what's your cousin like? What do you know? She, she's like me. Take me home. <laughs> No, Sarah's really nice. She's great. She's uh, cute. She's smart. And I'd like you guys to leave her the way you found her. <laughs> we made it in one hour and 20 minutes. Now, last time it took us an hour and 22 minutes. Gee, two bonus minutes to ski. This is gonna be great. <laughs> Oh, 
Should we bring you your meals out here? Oh, uh, sometimes I, j I just like to sit surrounded by nature and, and realize how lucky we are. Now, guys, Sarah's family is pretty straight, and this weekend is important to me. So don't go embarrassing me at Sarah's birthday party. Oh, who, us? No, you. Look at all the babes. Ugh. Disgusting. Hey! Hi! 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 Uh, Sarah Wilson, this is Kirk Stevens. Kirk is married. What she means is to you, someday. And you must be Andrew. Hi. Why don't you guys get changed? I gotta buy some shades. Oh, all right. She wants me. Yeah, you and diphtheria. You know, I've been to a lot of places, but this is perfect for your party. Nice jacket, Andrew. Ooh. Thanks. It's got this stuff astronauts would kill to get their hands on. Like what? Oh, uh, it, it, uh, it doesn't say. But I'm sure it's in the manual. Check out this construction. Jay. Mm. Wildlife Fund? UNICEF? Save the whales? Well, that's very nice of you. Whatever. Takes a big bite out of the tax bill. Oh, Mom, I forgot to tell you. That lady from Working Mother magazine called, and she wanted to know if she could come over earlier. How much earlier? Around now. Wait, wait. <clears throat> Hi, Aaron. This is Schellenbach. I was here first. Yes, by about 20 years. Benjamin. <clears throat> uh, Diane Mitchell, Dr. Benjamin Jeffcoat, and Ruth Schellenbach. How nice you've kept your maiden name. Are you out of your mind? <coughs> uh, well, maybe we should get started, huh? <laughs> sure. <laughs> Smell something burning. Oh, excuse me. Benjamin, can you get that phone? Oh, dear. <sighs> Hello? Dr. J, you're not at home. Aaron, hand me that towel, will you? I know, I'm... I know. That's why I'm answering here. We've got a problem. I've been acting really weird. My powers have been misfiring ever since I tried on Bob. You tried it on? How could you do something so completely irresponsive? Bull. find most difficult about being a working mother? Do not use my equipment unless I am present. I'm listening. Right. I won't leave my room. Bye. Excuse me. Come on, the girls are waiting. Well, I think you're supposed to ski down. I, I think I'll just stay here a, a little while. Come on, the worst thing that can happen to you is you break both legs. Loosen up.
Clemens, do not be such a wuss. Is it possible to move slower than gravity? Ugh. It's my first time. I could use a little help. <laughs> You're right. Okay, okay. Now keep your weight forward, your knees bent, and your hips are squared. What was that third thing again? Weight forward, knees bent, mm -hmm. hip okay. square. Whoa! 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 Oh, look out! Whoa! She's trying to make me jealous. <laughs> that was great. <laughs> that was really great. <laughs> She's good. <sighs> oh, come on, Clement. Get with the program. What a show off. <sighs> Okay, all right. Now follow me this time, okay? <laughs> nice, uh, nice uh, and uh, slow. <laughs> <laughs> all right, you ready? Okay. Glad to see those ski lessons paid off. Uh, Sarah, wait! It, it's not what you think. Why are you putting vanilla in an empty oven? It's an old realtor's trick. Makes the house smell sweet and homey. Did you clean up your room? No, it's an old kid's trick. You shut the door. Hey, that'll be Diane. You go get that for me, okay? <sighs> right. Hi, Diane. How are you? Fine. Things seem to have settled a little since uh, the last time. Thank goodness. <laughs> Can I get you some coffee? Well, that'd be great. Now, Stephanie, when did you decide to get back into the workforce? Excuse what? me, Mom? Honey, I'm kind of busy, okay? This is kind of important. <sighs> it's okay. What is it? Henry's not in his cage. <sighs> he didn't happen to leave a change of address by any chance. <laughs> I just thought you should know. Andrew, trust me, no one's gonna steal that post. Oh, um, what did you get Sarah for a birthday party? Uh, CD. Not bad. What would you get her? I was meaning to talk to you about that. I didn't really have time to go get anything, so I'd appreciate it if we could say it was from both of us. All right. You owe me ten bucks. Someone who can 
fly. Thanks, Coach. I'm very impressed with your young man. Excuse me? Kirk. It's refreshing to meet someone like that. I can't believe you told him you were going to be an accountant. Hey, I have a pencil with an eraser on it. Kirk! Mr. Wilson. I'd like you to meet a broker with Murray Finch and Simpson. Excellent firm. I must be hallucinating. You know, I can't believe that Andrew thought I'd fall for the poor little helpless skier routine. You did. Hi. Time for some cake. Sarah's so mad at me. Well, let's put it this way. Get a food taster. She just has to get to know me a little better. And things will be fine. <laughs> Mr. Wilson, you cracked me up. Excuse me. Mr. Wilson, I'd like you to meet my best friend, Andrew Clements. Andrew Clements, Mr. Wilson. Oh, it's it's a pleasure to meet you. How do you do? Uh, thank you. Oh, oh, uh, oh great cologne. Reservation, Dr. Benjamin Jeffcoat. Oh, right. You would never believe what I've been through. Sharp turn, ditch, wheel spinning, six-mile walk. You left one out. Guest punches out desk clerk. Describe a typical day for Stephanie Clements. Well, um, I usually get up about seven. Don't mind me. Here, Henry. Maybe I should come back at another time. All right. What'd you find, Henry? No, that video we rented last year. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Maybe this isn't going to work out. Are you kidding? This is going to make a great story. Henry! I mean, you're doing an article on women who can handle a career and a household. I can't even handle getting through an interview. Stephanie, the magazine is called Working Mother, not uh, a Superwoman. I mean, a lot of women find it very difficult to be a successful mother and have a successful career. I admire you. Oh, thank you. So when we get to the top, everybody just stay with me. Sarah! Right, everybody... Um, I'm, I'm real sorry about everything. I've been feeling a little off lately. What a great day. Surrounded by nature, makes you realize how lucky we all are. I thought I told you to stay inside. I'm fine. I haven't done anything weird in almost 12 hours. Of course, I was sleeping. What are you looking for? I have absolutely no idea. Nothing weird has happened? No! Sarah hates me. Jackie hates me. Kirk's going to become an accountant. Everything's just about normal. I've told you time and time again infinitum. Do not use my equipment unless I am present. I said I was sorry. Hey, guys. Ah. 
And another thing, Andrew. Sarah's in trouble. I'm not finished lecturing you! I'm gonna take a shortcut! I've lost my powers again! Why don't you say it a little louder? I've got to do something anyway. Save your life, Hug? Carry on. Oh. I'm coming! Ah, ah. You're fine. Fine meaning my powers are back? Right. Your loss of control of your superpowers is just a temporary side effect. Oh. No more misfires. Hopefully not. That's a relief. Working Mother Magazine scheduled a big photo shoot of the family, and I wouldn't want anything to go wrong. I hope you're not going to try to freak me out by pretending your powers are out of whack. Come on, Dr. J. You know me better than that. <laughs> 